were traveling, usually across the sea, they needed food that would last, so they brought live animals with them. They took a lot of room though, so they didn't have room for dishes. Instead, the cook would make pie crusts to hold the food. These early pies were known as coffins, because these terms referred to boxes or baskets, and open top pies were called traps. These were the only baking containers back then, so basically everything was in pie form. It was good though because it cooked the meat and sealed in all the juices, so the travelers had slightly more enjoyable food. The earliest remains of pies date back to around 9,500 BC. There were even pie remains found in Pharaoh Ramses II's tomb, and a recipe for chicken pie was found written on a stone that dates back to around 2000 BC. Within time, the pies made their way to Spain where they added salts and spices to preserve them and add more flavor. Then around the first century, the Romans discovered how to make a cake-like pastry called lugum, similar to a modern day cheesecake. However, it was most commonly used as a sacrifice to the gods. Then from Greece, the Romans traveled around Europe and brought the ideas of pies with them. The use of the term pie was originated in England around the 14th century, and then when the pilgrims came to the New World, they brought their recipes with them. Then when they met the Native Americans, they were taught about fruits and berries and added them to their pies for new, exciting flavors. And that is how the common known pies that we eat today were formed.